we know you as such a talented blues guitarist and singer. Here you are up for a Juno. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah, we're thrilled. <laughs> this uh, album, I mean, this is like hit the charts. Number one, 15 weeks. What I found very unique about it is, is that you chose to make this very, you know, impromptu, live. We wanted to make an album that was live. And, and when I say live off, I mean live off the floor. So we're in the studio recording live. It's not a gig. And so we basically were all in one big room and we are all playing in real time. There's no overdub. There's no tracking on this album, which is quite unusual for a modern album of any kind, even a blues album. In the decades that you've been doing it, you've obviously transitioned your sound, your performance. What would you say is the headspace you're in now for, for your music? Well, I think I'm just in a really good place. The wonderful thing about being a blues artist um, and something I knew when I was young is that blues artists age really well. We're like fine wines. Like you're, you're not really a great blues artist until you're kind of at the age I'm at now. I turn 54 tomorrow. Just in case. 